Hello, glad to see that you have found the getting started folder and this is just a, a, a short video that describes some of the material inside of the folder itself. The, the lesson objectives for this folder as mentioned, I will, uh, feel free to read those. Basically in this lesson uh, I want to provide students an opportunity to grow familiar with um, how the course is set up and some of the material we will be looking at. I ask students to participate in um, the discussion board that, that serves as an introduction for themselves. Please make sure to review the course syllabus and participate in the course discussion boards. It's really important to participate in the student introduction discussion board and the course syllabus discussion board by the due date. Students who fail to participate in these discussion boards by the due date will be withdrawn by the will be withdrawn from the course due to non-participation. So we have to have evidence by the due date for this lesson that you have participated within the discussion board. Uh, uh, due dates or, or assignments are due by their respective due date, which you will find um, within the table under assignments by 11.55 p.m. of that particular day. I've also included some hints, tips, tricks, uh, that I have collected over the years related to online course information that you can download and I've also included the discussion board rubric that I will be using to, to grade the discussion boards and I will be asking folks uh, in the final discussion board for this lesson to give us a definition of what is prevention and our discussion boards need to be well thought out well constructed not repetitive of other students post Simply saying, I agree, it is not a discussion board, and you will not receive credit for that. Discussion boards must include a high level of, of thought, consideration, and effective writing. Plus, for most of our discussion boards, as indicated per each respective discussion board, you will be asked to respond to one of your fellow students at least. So make sure those responses are professional, well thought out, and reflective of the message that you're trying to convey. Again, um, I'm always here to help. One of my roles is to make sure that I'm, I'm responsible to you. I want students to be responsible to our course, but I also want to be responsible to you in terms of um, having a high quality and, and highly interactive experience. I'm really excited about this class. I've spent the past four years involved in multiple environmental prevention approaches um, within North Carolina and Virginia. Um, I was at Forsyth Tech for four years, actually five years, as Human Services Program Coordinator, left in August um, for another college in Virginia, and um, administered about a million dollars uh, prevention funding the past couple of years on the federal and state level. Environmental prevention is something that, that certainly has a place in our society. Uh, I'm excited to share my experiences with you um, in, inside of human services and substance abuse and certainly within the field of prevention. Please let me know if I can help. I'm excited to be here with you and, and take care.